Now that we have made our Mialica pinch pots, we're going to glaze them. First, we are going to wax the bottom, like in the example on the right, leaving about an eighth of an inch clearance from the bottom. The wax is back by the glaze brushes, and we're just going to put one thin layer around the foot of the pot, going up the side about an eighth of an inch. Now, you have to be careful not to dribble the wax accidentally, or you will have a spot where the glaze will resist and it will not stick. You can glaze all the way into the center of the foot. So as you see from the side, it went up about an eighth of an inch and I had to be very careful not to dribble. Be careful of transferring wax from your fingertip. Next, we're going to mix up the white Mialica glaze. This is the Amico LG11 Opaque White Base Glaze. And I mix it up. And then we're going to be using tongs to hold our cup. Once the foot is waxed and dry, you pick it up with tongs securely holding it. And then we're going to plunge it down into the glaze, making sure that the glaze is making contact all over and briskly shake it off on the side of the bucket. You really want to get all that excess glaze to drip up and off the top. That white glaze tends to be a little bit thick. Next, a nice step is to kind of sponge off a little bit on the bottom. I would be holding it in my hand if I weren't holding the camera in my hand. So get some of that glaze off and then set it on one of the plastic trays that we have near the bucket. We'll give it 24 hours to dry and then we will come back and we will start the Mialica painting. The white is our base glaze. Now the Mialica colors are back on the lower left hand shelf on the low fire section. You can see that the tiles have a diagonal pattern and they have indicators on the back as to the label of the glaze. Now, I also have some new glazes besides the Mialica right here. This is the teacher's palette glazes. They are replacing the Mialica because they have discontinued them. Now I am going to get, draw the design that I wanted to do and I'm referencing the cup there on the left. And you can use pencil and draw directly on top of the white base glaze. If you make a mistake, it will not be visible. Just try not to scratch the glaze off as you draw. And once you have it um, drawn, then you can go ahead and paint everything in. Now you only need a single layer of the Mialica colors. One dip in the white and a single brush layer. I never recommend doing three brush layers over it because it will get a funny matte texture. Notice that I have gone around the circles. You don't want to try to paint a light color over a dark color. It's better to just go around it and paint it. Here I'm putting the last liner uh, accent on it like I had in the original cup. And lastly, wipe that bottom.